The one-to-one -one Chromebook initiative has changed the way I'm learning um, because one of the great benefits is its offline um, usage. So if you're on a sports bus or you have activities um, that prevent you from using the internet or you don't have any internet at home, it's really helped um, being able to work on um, projects and papers and worksheets um, without the use of the internet, which is one great benefit. Uh, in many ways, I'm able to access documents much easier. I don't have to go to a computer lab, open up, well, sign in, open up Docs and whatnot. I can just pull out my Chromebook, open it up, and get right onto Google Docs. It's much easier. Um, it's helped a lot because I can have the Chromebook with me all day, and I can work on stuff for classes anytime I need to without having to share it with anybody else. Um, it helps with uh, homeworks, and we use less papers than we did last year. And it helps tra to translate English to Spanish, and it's very helpful. Um, being able to bring it home this year is really nice for getting my homework done. But I also find it nice that I don't have to ruffle through all my papers to find what we need to do that day. Another great benefit to having my own Chromebook um, is like the independence it offers. Uh, no longer do we have to share uh, Chromebooks or make sure that one's available to use. Each class every day we can expect to bring our Chromebook and to use it. Um, that kind of consistency is really helpful. Additionally, um, it allows for a lot of collaboration between us students because we can work on projects together using um, that compatibility on the Google Docs, Google Sheets, and um, Google Slides. Um. El año pasado, de el tiempo de ahora, me ha ayudado muchísimo en comprender los temas, en cómo poder relacionarme con las clases de hoy en día, en entender mejor, por ejemplo, algunas palabras que no entiendo y, y a traducir mis contenidos que para poder estudiar en mi casa. It's been really easy. I feel like over the past couple years we've been like slowly transitioning to more digital and it, it wasn't that hard this year. Uh, it's been pretty smooth. I've been able to get with the, I guess you could say, get with the program much easier than I have in the past. It's been pretty easy and smooth just because of how easy the access is to all the information on the internet and the Google Docs for writing assignments, projects, and stuff like that. Uh, one of the benefits, I think, is probably feedback. I'm able to submit a, a draft paper and um, receive comments back, which is really nice. Um, so being able to work on it without always having to be face-to-face uh, -face with my teacher is something that's really beneficial. Uh, one I would say is that People can access, they can access their students' documents much easier, and if it's just a draft, they can look at the document and say what the student might need help with. I think it makes it easier for them to explain how the project is supposed to be set out or an assignment is supposed to be set out because everyone's on the same, everyone's using the same materials, they all got their own Chromebook. With Google Classroom, it makes it easier to turn in assignments, see who's finished them and who hasn't finished them. And I think it's a great initiative. Um, the Chromebook, the new Chromebook initiative, has changed the way that I teach. In that I can deliver material in a digital way rather than running off a lot of copies or spending more time. Um, delivering lecture to students where I can link um, YouTube videos or images or websites or documents right to classroom um, and students have immediate access to that. They each can have their own copy of different documents. Um, it makes for a more paperless, the goal is paperless for me at least, um, but for now it is a more paperless classroom. Well, I have to say that it's changed the way I teach by have been giving the students almost instant access to the information that they need.
been awesome. I think that um, it's, it's offered a, a huge amount of opportunity to my students um, to be able to explore different ways of accessing information as well as sharing information with me, with their peers, with people outside of school. Um, it's just, it's really been exciting to see them really take to it. Now the transition's been a little rocky because as I mentioned, the, the students are focused on the new device. Um, they haven't accepted complete responsibility for it yet, so sometimes they forget it, sometimes they forget to charge it. And if they're taking it from class to class, I think in the long run that'll give them you know, more responsibility as they, they grow into the habit of using it. But um, as I said, the biggest problem is uh, the wandering and uh, going to websites where they shouldn't be. The GoGuardian program has helped that but uh, we still have a ways to go with that. Benefits to the students is uh, that first of all, they have almost instant access to the uh, internet for the information they might need for uh, any task that I might assign them. I don't have to re uh, reserve the library computers or any other computers for them. They have that right with them. It's wonderful for them and they can communicate with each other as well as with the teacher and electronically and it, it's a wonderful thing that they can do that. Accessibility has been a huge benefit to our students. I know that um, a number of our students don't have A, internet access at their home and B, access to a computer. Um, I know that some have to travel to relatives' homes, they have to go to public libraries, um, or they spend a great deal of time here after the school day has ended. So it's offered them accessibility to, you know, these digital tools that they, haven't, they hadn't had before.